Nothing says status, wealth, and prestige quite like a private jet. But flying in one of these jets isn't just about the show. Everybody thinks it's typically rock stars and celebrities, but almost uh, all the time it's actually uh, successful business owners who use their aircraft to help grow their businesses. And it's not as rare as it used to be. When it comes to price, as you can imagine, the sky is the limits. A private jet like this, it's a CJ2+, Plus. it can hold up to eight passengers, runs upwards of seven million dollars, but others can go as high as 50 million. So let's take a look inside. Absolutely. Wow, this is nice. So, this is a private jet, huh? Welcome aboard. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. You're talking about very comfortable, luxurious leather seats, a, a beautiful woodwork interior, and um, uh, fine, uh, fine china. Um, really just a really beautiful, elegant interior. I've personally been on an airplane that has a master bedroom with a 60-inch television and a 5,000 movie uh, DVD system on the airplane. Really impressive. But to ride in one, Citation 525, you don't have to buy one. A lot of folks come to our company and ask, can we go to the Bahamas on a fishing trip, on a guy's trip for a weekend, take our family on vacation, and it's surprisingly reasonable. The price for that? Let's say six or eight folks to the Bahamas for the weekend. It ends up working out to be in the neighborhood of about $800 a person to fly round trip. And if you have the money, trust me. It's worth it. Uh, a lot of folks I know say, I can always fly to the West Coast for less on the airlines, and I will never argue with that. But one thing they can't argue with is you could never fly in a more luxurious, classy environment than on a private jet. Because after just one ride, oh yeah, I'm sold. Fly away on my cell phone. Once you've traveled on a private jet, it will be very difficult to go stand in line in security at the airport again. This perfect weather. Bye.